Okay, uh, subject is interpreting trapezoids. We have a trapezoid on a graph of pay rate in dollars per year versus clock time in years. And the information we have initially <coughs> is that there's a pay rate of $40,000 here, pay rate of $55,000 here, and a 10-year span. So we want to calculate the slope and the area of this trapezoid. Of course, I've already calculated those and have those results written down here. But you should uh, perhaps do your own calculation and uh, before you look too closely at what's been done here. Anyhow, the slope <coughs> of the approximating segment, the segment from here to here, is what? The rise and the rise uh, of, of sketched the dotted line here at a right angle to the altitudes. And the rise, of course, goes from here to here. It's the change in the vertical coordinate as we move from this point to this point. And that's $15,000 per year. Because, of course, pay rate is in dollars per year. The rise will be in the same uh, units. Uh, and I'll write that out more formally. $55,000 over years minus $40,000 over years. And that's $15,000 over years, okay, or dollars per year. Now, I wrote it this way rather than with the dollar sign first, just so the units would all be here so we can manipulate them properly. The run, of course, is this distance here, the 10 years, uh, or this uh, change in the clock time, 10 years. Okay, the slope then is rise divided by run, $15,000 per year divided by 10 years which comes out 10 into 15,000 is 1,500, and dollars over years divided by years. I've written here as dollars over years over years, read as dollars per year per year. Okay, what does this represent? It represents the fact that on the average, every year, your salary goes up $1,500 per year. I might have said 15,000 a minute ago, it's 1,500. Uh, $1,500 per year every year. Your salary or pay rate goes up by this much on the average every year. Naturally, we don't know exactly what happened to the pay rate between here and here, but that's an average. Okay, so we can say the average rate at which salary or pay rate, whichever way we want to read it, changes with respect to clock time is $1,500 per year per year. Now, that could be written $1,500 per year squared. Uh, dollars over years divided by years gives us dollars over years squared. But the meaning is clear if we re read it as dollars per year per year. Uh, more compact the other way. Easier to do the units the other way. So they're perfectly good advantages. But right now we're trying to understand what this means. Okay, so if we read this in terms of pay rate, it's the average rate at which the pay rate changes with respect to clock time. You have the word rate coming in here twice, and you need to sort out what that means, and that's something I leave you to think about. Okay, well now, the area of the trapezoid. <coughs> How do we get the area of a trapezoid? Well, remember, we take the midpoint here, um, and we slice off this triangle here, and paste it on here, and we get a rectangle. Uh, midpoint of the slope segment gives us the point at which to cut, and that gives us a rectangle whose dimensions are the width by the average of the two altitudes. So to find the area, we take the average of the graph altitudes, straightforward calculation. We add the two graph altitudes uh, and divide by two, and we get $47,500 per year, the average of $40,000 a year and $55,000 a year. The width is 10 years, so we multiply these two dimensions. The average altitude by the width gives us the area $47,500 per year multiplied by 10 years. Uh, dollars times years over years is dollars times years divided by years. Years divided by years is unity, and multiply that by dollars, and we get dollars. And of course, 47,500 times 10 is 475,000. So we get $475,000. And the meaning of this is pretty easy to ascertain. Uh, at an average rate of $47,500 per year, in 10 years, we should make 10 times $47,500 or $475,000. And that agrees with our 
more formal calculation of the area. We complete this by labeling the slope $1,500 per year per year and the area $47,500.